Hi there, Capricorn. It's my lady. So happy to have you back. Sorry I've been away for some time. I was getting some very much needed, uh, let's say, restore my energy. <laughs> okay, because I felt like I was really um, burnt out, let's say. I had to take care of some personal things and everything is fine. Okay, and I am back and I'm here to bring you today, Capricorn, your April 2021 reading. So how are you? And so happy to have you back. All right. So this is what we're going to do. I'm going to uh, give you four rows, Capricorn. All right. Um, I'm also going to give you a bonus reading. Not this one here. So then I'm going to call this one your bonus for April 2021. <coughs> 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 All right, Capricorn. All right. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. Please give me a like. Okay, and uh, why don't you comment? Let me know if this reading resonates for you. Okay, don't forget to look for your bonus 2020, uh, April 2021 reading. Okay, so let's jump right in Capricorn. All right, so Capricorn. All right, I am clearly showing here um, some alone time. Okay, I see some alone time here. Uh, some time here where you you take um, you're basically um, I just heard like restoring your energy maybe where Capricorn you're restoring your energy you're taking time for yourself your um um i want to say just taking some time for yourself you know like um uh, i just heard like maybe regain of energy you know cleansing of your energy as well all right um I see you uh, with this time alone that you are going to restore some strength, okay? Some much needed strength is what I just heard. Okay. All right, I am showing here forces of life, all right? Meaning like changes. Um. Here you're being asked to have patience because there are changes coming in. All right. Um, I'm showing the Empress here where I'm showing some uh, new beginnings. And um, basically just something, a start of something here is what I'm showing. Okay. Now... Capricorn, I got a, a few elements here that are standing out to me, like uh, Virgo, I see Leo, I see Leo twice, okay, um, I am showing Scorpio, I'm showing uh, Capricorn, uh, I see Pisces here, I see Libra with um just the scale okay so there, there's uh something there's some justice here i want to say okay um where at first where something wasn't fair it's or wasn't fair at the, at the time and it's now fair i'm showing um capricorn I really feel Scorpio here very strongly for you. 
Okay. So it wants to come out. Okay. Okay. Um, I also want to say here, Capricorn, um, where there was uh, some success. I feel like you like let it go. All right, because it's showing me like some type of like abandonment. Um, either you abandoned or someone abandoned um, is what I'm showing here. I see uh, a lot, like let's say um, a, a burden, like you uh, carrying a huge load on your back. It's very heavy, okay? Very, very heavy. Very tiring. I feel like, uh, I feel some it being so tiring and so, um, just taking your energy is what I just heard. All right. Um, I see some type of disappointments, Capricorn. I mean, clearly you have the world in your hands. That's what I'm showing. You had a lot of options in front of you. All right. Some options were for you and some options were not. In other words, you know, some were meant to be or some were meant for you and others were not. Okay, I do see a King of Pentacles here. That's a Taurus Virgo Capricorn. That could be you here in your own uh, reading. All right. I am also showing um, a union of two families possibly. Okay, and you holding on to something really tight. All right. And whatever you were holding on to, Capricorn, I'm showing that you did not care whether you got hurt in the long run uh, for it because this is what you wanted at the time, okay? I'm also showing the King of Wands here. King of Wands could be um, a fire element, uh, Arius, Leo, Sagittarius. Um, male or female, because I don't want to attach genders to the cards, uh, depending on who's, uh, watching. Okay. Uh, I see something from afar, maybe someone that has, um, gone, uh, either walked away or had to leave or move is what I'm showing here. Okay. And, um, let's see here. Okay. Um. Okay. So, whatever it is that had to walk away or had to move or uh, something that's from afar. Um. I'm feeling like you know. It was um. I almost feel like it was supposed to happen like you know like um <clears throat> it was draining you is what I'm feeling here it was very draining this one wants to come out could be friendship or I see that you're leaning in on friendship for inspiration um but I guess you can't help thinking of, you know, what happened there. Although I don't see the past card here. Oh, yes, I do. <laughs> the Wheel of Fortune. Absolutely. There's a past here that you're not letting go of, Capricorn. All right. There's actually a disappointment here, you know, where the divine is handing you a cup. And you're refusing to accept that cup because you're disappointed. Right now, you don't see anything before you. Your thoughts are in the past. All right, you don't see any opportunities that coming that are coming your way. Like these opportunities, whether they're meant to be or not, you're not really looking at them. Okay, you're holding on to something that wasn't that wasn't for you. You know, I see strength here though. You have, um, I see strength here. I see the infinity single uh, symbol. Okay, that one wants to fall out. Okay, um, 
It's also letting me know that whatever happened here that gone on in the past, um, you know, um, I don't see anything as far as, um, like it ending because I still feel like it's still fresh. If it has not happened, it's going to happen. This one came out. All right. There is a transformation. Okay. And after the transformation comes peace. So there are changes that are coming. Keep in mind, like I'm letting you know here that everything was done, you know, for, uh, for, for you. In other words, for a better, you know, for the well-being, um, where there's changes that had to come in so that, you know, you could have that peace of mind, peace, um, peace very much needed. I just heard, All right? You need it. I mean, the, the need of being in peace, it was like, um, where you could sleep at night because I feel like there were sleepless nights. Okay. Um, strength is coming in twice for you here. Okay. Again, new beginnings. But it's telling you, you have to have patience. Everything happens for a reason, Capricorn. You know? What's meant to be will come in. And it will be. There's no stopping it when, when it is meant to be and it's divinely guided. This one wants to come out. Alright, so the energy is gaining momentum. Okay? Allow those good energies to come in, Capricorn. Allow them to um, uh, let them change you, if anything. Those good energies. Whoa. Okay, we got a lot of cards that came in. Now the ones that fell on the floor are the ones that came face up. Let me grab them. So you got confidence is your key to success, okay? And what do you need to release so it's clearly letting you know you gotta let go of the past you have to let go of what it is that's bringing you down and holding you down in those memories okay you have to move on you have to heal it's time for closure capricorn whatever it is that's bringing you down you have to let go of it it's hurting you more than it is um um it's hurting you more to keep these memories and whatever it is that is holding you back, all right? It's hurting you more than it is. Like, what do I want to say here? I want to say that it's hurting you more to keep it than it is, um, you know, to let it go. So once you let it go, you know, it's not going to hurt anymore. It's not going to, you know, release it is what it's telling you to do here, clearly telling you what do you need to release what's holding you back you know there's a new there's a leo here too okay is it because of a leo capricorn that you're going through what you're going through okay we got one that flipped upward Bring love into the situation. Okay? Love yourself. You know, let allow love to come in. When you love yourself first, you know, and release yourself from this burden or this negativity that's holding you down, this past, these memories, you know, you're able to, um, you'll, you're able to love yourself. And that way, be able to love someone else. This is what it's clearly telling you, Capricorn. All right? And this is what I have for you, Capricorn, for April 2021. Bye.